Hi everyone, we're Pop Couple. I'm James. Lisa. And we're here to do another Tokyo Treat. Yep. So this is the June box for Tokyo Treat. Mm -hmm. uh, we recently just did the May box. Yep. Um, they came like a couple days apart okay. from each other. So yeah, we figured let's uh, let's get to it. Um, so the June boxes. Uh, theme is Hanami Picnic. Um, so yeah, we'll we'll get into this. So we did notice that there is some tea in here, so we've got some tea steeping right now. Yep. Uh, and when we get there, we'll get there. Uh, so uh, we get the premium box, so it has a few extra things over the classic box. Uh, we'll get into it. Did uh, you show them the box? I have not shown the box yet. Oh, okay. So. Um, with these, we've done a couple of these. This is our third the, one. This is our third one. Mixed reviews on uh, <laughs> the cool stuff in here. So again, these are snacks um, and candies from Japan. Yeah. We figure why not try them? What's the worst thing that can happen? They it taste terrible. Taste good. Um, Which I find funny because he's extremely picky with foods, mm -hmm. but yet he's willing right away to try these. But if I make something that looks funny for dinner, he doesn't want to try it. <laughs> She's got a point. Um, <laughs> we should show these to your parents. They need to watch these videos. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So, I think probably, I think still the worst thing was the toilet bowl cleaner, which yes. was in the first box. It was like a lemon flavored, mm -mm. pumice stone looking thing mm -mm. that um, was, was not bad. good. Uh, so, let's get into <laughs> this one. So, again, this is. Uh, Hanami Picnic. I probably am terribly pronouncing that, but yeah. Is what it is. Yep. So the first thing we've got in here, or that's on our list, is Furuta uh, Sakura Mochi Cookies. So that looks like that should be this. So this is a big bag. Yeah. There's usually one big bag yeah. per box, and it's usually like Kit Kats or something. So. So. I'm assuming these are somewhat similar. Yeah. So there you go. They look like it's they're individually wrapped inside. Yep. So I will give you one. Whoa, where'd that smell come? No, it's not this. Maybe it was the tea I'm Might smelling. Be the tea. So we each have one. Let's give these a shot. Um Yeah. So there you smell go. It. That's what it looks like. It smells interesting. It doesn't smell very flattering. Oh, it's horrid. It's not very good. Oh. Nope. 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 That's really bad. Yeah, it's not Ugh. good. Not good at all. Um, I don't even know what that is. It's not good flavoring. That's what it is. Uh, so, oh. we don't like that one. And it's not soft and moist like it said it was. No, definitely not. Oh. Um, wow. It's like a cigarette aftertaste. It is. It, yes. Yeah, it's, it, it's like you just smoked and it's in your teeth. Or just licked an ashtray. That's not good. <laughs> mm, licking ashtrays. Uh, so the first one, um, not good. Uh -uh. Uh, and the next thing is a shrimp chip, so I don't know how that's gonna help. <coughs> that's probably gonna work really well with um, cigarette ash taste. Wow. Why? Uh, so yeah, so these are um, shrimp, shrimp chips. chips. I think we had shrimp chips the first time. I think so. They weren't that bad. No. Can I have my water to like rinse the cigarette ash out? Ooh, not part of the box. Alright, get a couple of these out. Here's one for you. It's still in there. Yeah, I know. Alright, here we go. That smelly shrimp. Tastes fine. Not bad at all. Tastes good. I do. They're okay. He's more of a shrimp like. I like yeah. I like shrimp. He likes shrimp. Yeah. So they definitely taste like shrimp. Like shrimp. Not strong, but No. Not bad. So <clears throat> Well, yeah, way better than the uh, first, first thing, one. That first thing was horrid. Yes. Oh. 
Those might have to get sent in random boxes to people. <laughs> oh, hey, we have a Sakura cookie for you. Right? They're delicious. Don't watch mm. this video. Uh, watch the video before. No. Um, all right. Next thing on the list is the tea. Is the tea. So this is uh, Lipton Sakura tea. So this is the uh, little box and bag that it comes in. Um, there are 12 pyramid style tea bags in here. It smells like tea. You're more of a tea drinker than I it am. It does. Though. I am. You want it? Yeah. In so. our Deadpool mug. So yes. Mmm. It's a good tea. I'd drink it. I'd definitely drink it. Probably send it with you to work. Yep. You get it? Well, I'll try I'll it. I'll try out. it. I'm not a. Ooh, that's really hot. It's hot, yeah. I'm not a hot beverage drinker. I like everything cold, so. Yeah, yeah, it's easier if you. It just tastes like hot water. But I also, again, I don't have a taste for tea. Yeah. Like, I'll drink uh, cold tea. Yes. Like, Which we like can Arizona, always, for yeah. instance. I mean, we could always make it cold. But this doesn't right. really have a flavor to me. But I also, yeah, I don't really prefer hot tea. Yeah, I, um, I I'll drink this. I have reached drink old it. lady status. Yeah, I'm old man status. Yeah. That's cool. All right. Uh, what do we got next? It's supposed to be gum, but I think we're just going to skip, skip the gum until the uh, end. Yeah, what's the This is the gum. That. Ah. So we're going to bring that in the end so yes. that we don't have gum in our mouth and yada yada. Yeah. So the next is a nori potato stick. That yellow one, I think. This, yeah, right here. Yeah. Okay. This potato s snack <coughs> is seasoned with nori, whatever that is. So it has a yummy, salty seaweed flavor we all know and adore. Don't forget to pack this in your Hanami picnic basket. It wouldn't be a Hanami picnic without nori chips. So on the bottom of this, it looks like actually they have baked potatoes. Oh, baked potatoes and seaweed. Okay. Sounds like a delicious combination. <clears throat> if it's seaweed, it's gonna stink. And it looks like a toilet bowl stick. It really does. It doesn't stink too bad. No, it smells like a seaweed snack. There's a hole in the middle. See if, are you gonna be able to get it back in? Uh, I don't know. That's what she said. Hello. Right. All right. So bottoms up. Yeah. These things are all very like awkward to eat sometimes. Mm -hmm. Oh, you don't like it. I saw the base. <laughs> what does it taste like? Weird. I want to know what this tastes like. All right. You know the little Chinese crackers that they've got like soy sauce flavor and then there's a seaweed flavored one no. and I they're know. like shiny. They I do like little peas in them. I, so I don't eat Chinese food. It it's not like Chi it's like Americanized Chinese crackers. That's what the sea the seaweed flavored one of those tastes just like this. But texture wise it's different cuz those are shiny and smooth and these are crunchier and Flaky? Yeah. It's not bad. I'd eat this. You can. I'll eat that. Eat it all you want. Eat my stick. Mm hmm. All right. Yeah, that's exactly what it tastes like. I don't like. That's okay. All right. Next one we should both like. We should. The next oh. one is nacho cheese Pringles. Yeah. Like, why that's in Japan and not in the US? I don't know. It's got a little like sombrero on the Pringles guy. Anyway. Yeah, so, yeah. I find that odd that that's not in the US. Well, we might find out why it's not in the US here. Because it tastes like caca? So they're tiny Pringles too. Baby Pringles. Those are good. Those are cheese flavored Pringles. There's no nacho involved. They they are similar to the cheddar. They're exactly like the cheddar. I'll cheddar you. I'll nacho you. Mm -hmm. It ain't and nacho cheese, boy. <laughs> All right, those are fine. Those are yeah. And they taste like the cheddar cheese we ones we have here. Yes. You're not missing much. 
All right, crushed strawberry pocky. That would be this guy. No. No. That'd be this guy. Sorry, wrong thing. Why does it say crushed? Because it looks like it's got like little strawberry. Oh, I was like, what do they take the sticks and just? It's probably they dried the strawberries. So it says Pocky fans are going crazy over this crushed strawberry Pocky. Enjoy the rich taste of strawberries interwoven with bittersweet cocoa coated pretzel. Oh, pretzel. Oh, and they're melted. A little melted, yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Will you share these with friends or enjoy the whole box? I never knew they were pretzels. I thought it was like a chocolate cookie. Uh, I think usually it is a cookie. Uh, I think they labeled it as a pretzel though. Yeah, these melted as well. Yeah. But they'll still be fine. So There's two. nothing daring. Oh. That's fine. I'll take this little tiny chunk. Okay. You can take the big chunk. Yep. They're fine. Nothing that we don't have here, I feel like. Yeah. I don't taste a difference between crushed strawberry or not. You it just tastes like strawberry. Yeah. That's good. All right. Definitely good. So the next one is Yaukin Poriki. Okay. German potato sticks. So, so that's so this. If they're German, why are they in the Tokyo treat box? Well, it's probably Japanese take on German. Oh, they taste like German potatoes. What are German potatoes? Yummy pretzel sticks is what they say they are. Doesn't smell like anything crazy. It's a breadstick. Basically, yeah. A very skinny breadstick. It's got a little bit of flavor to it, kind of like a potato. Tastes like a Ritz but cracker. Doesn't it? No, I don't think it does. Okay. I think it tastes like a Ritz cracker <laughs> in stick form. So, those aren't bad. Those are edible. Yeah. They'd be good with soup, but he doesn't eat soup. I don't eat soup. We don't need this package, right? No. All right. All right. What do we got next? Ramune energy drink bubble candy. I believe that would be this. It says these candies are blah, blah, blah. They have that classic Ramoon energy drink flavor and evaporate into little foamy bubbles in your mouth. Oh, so these could be fun. Oh, or violating in your mouth. <laughs> what do they look like? Um, just like a disc. Like pop rock? Oh, like a disc? Yeah. Don't take the yellow pill. How many are in there? Oh, like a pack pack. Yeah. It foams up kind of like a zop. Mm. Not quite as much, not Zots as foamy better. foamy. But. It's. It's okay. Yeah. I don't know what energy drink it's supposed to be like mm. a lemony one and not a very good one but then again neither of us really like energy drinks i'm good anyway <laughs> do you still want yours Give me a hand. Okay. <laughs> not the garbage no yeah I just, whoa. Oh, I was gonna say you chewed it? I chewed and get chewed. <laughs> <coughs> I don't recommend chewing these. <coughs> <coughs> She's gonna foam at the mouth and die. <laughs> no. No? Okay. Okay. Woo! There we go. Those kind of taste like medicine, too. Mm, I know. All right, let's uh, move on to the next item. And Pan Man, soft corn four pack. <coughs> All right. So it's supposed to be soft corn? That's what it says. 
It says ring shaped corn snacks, yummy veggie chip snack, blah, blah, blah. So it's a veggie chip snack. Interesting. What do they look like? They look like Cheerios on the package. Mm. So, like... Oh, it's this smell. I keep smelling something. Oh, not Cheerios. No. It's one for you. Asian big penis rings. <laughs> so. It doesn't really taste like anything. Mm -hmm. In fact, I would probably say that this tastes kind of like um, corn pops. There's those little. Uh, I can't remember the name of it. it. You give your baby for them to like eat. Oh, like the little pour out of the thing and they're star shaped? Yes. I that. don't know what they're called. That, that's kind of like what it baby tastes snacks? Like. Yeah. You've been eating baby snacks? Well, when I had my kids were babies. <laughs> you ate their snacks? I tried one. <laughs> I was curious. <laughs> so, but that's basically what it reminds me of. It's just like a little corn. It just dissolves in your yeah. mouth. So, those don't, aren't very exciting. <clears throat> I'm, by the way, I'm still sorry I chewed this. <laughs> All right, what's next? Yao Kin Kinakao cake. Red packet, that thing. Yep. Yep. Okay. It says, OMG, these Kinako cakes are to die for. They have a chewy mochi mochi texture and they're yummy Kinako or roasted soybean flavor is super delicious. Eat these with a cup of Sakura tea for the perfect picnic treat. Oh, I've got my Sakura tea. We do. <laughs> they look like miniature bread loaves. All right, let me get my tea ready. There's something hard in the middle. That's what she said. <laughs> no, there is. When you squish it, it's like a bad zit and it's got something hard in the middle. Or is that a good zit? If it pops good, it's a good zit. Yeah, it le legit looks like you're gonna pop a bad zit. Yum! I can't wait to taste mine. The mochi tastes like normal. It's so it's roasted soybeans. Yeah. Though, which are actually sweet. Mm-hmm. Right fly. It does go good with the security though. It's not bad. I'm a little surprised at how sweet mm -hmm. the roasted soybeans are. Makes me want to watch a Dr. Pimple Popper video. Yay! So. Interesting. Not bad. It is good with the security. All right, <clears throat> what do we have next? Candy apple do-it-yourself kit. Oh boy. So if you've seen our other videos, do-it-yourself kits usually don't go very well, no. over very well with us. Um, oh, let's try this one. Maybe this one will be better. Maybe, and our flurkin is back. So this one is a classic candy apple treat. They melted. A bit, yeah. All right, so we got our toothpick. You want to hold on to the toothpick? Sure thing, chicken wing. Toothpick. Stab the kitty. Ow! Then we have... She'll make it taste better. Right. Um, two little spots in here. You probably can't see that very well. We got sprinkles. Yep. And we got a sauce pack. Um, I was expecting something that was a little more caramely. Yeah. It is not caramely. I wonder if it's like that red apple stuff. It could be. So, I will go ahead and dump our sprinkles into one of these spots here. I still want to know, like from the first video that I asked, that anyone that's actually in Japan, is this stuff that's actually eaten? Or is this like the stuff that they're like, haha, we're sending the Americans? <laughs> Just curious. That doesn't look good. At all. It really looks great. It looks like fake blood. Like very. There's nothing in there. Stop. He's like licking the bowl clean for no reason. 
It looks like a very gooey blood. Go for it. Right. So, again, you probably can't see very well. You, that's you go. good. All right, so you're supposed to take one of the pink apple things. Which are all stuck which together. Which are all stuck together because, uh, again, they got kind of hot. You dip it into the sauce and then dip it into the sprinkles. <laughs> Hold on. There we go. The toothbrick broke, by the way. Oh. When I was doing that, it shattered. Gotcha. Broken so, toothpick. So, got it on the toothpick. Ooh, okay, they gotta see that. You ready? <laughs> There's the sugar rush. <laughs> Sprinkles. So that's what it looks like. It smells very, very, very sweet. It's a little sour, but it's not horrid. It's like a Laffy Taffy with sauce. Gotcha. And, spring and crunchy sprinkles. It's not bad. I expected worse. I don't think I'd finish the container of them. One is plenty. Yeah. Because it's a very sweet. That's super sweet. But it's not awful. I'm still trying to go. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. It's right. I have three more things. <laughs> so, next thing up is the toilet bowl stick. So. We are back to the Umaibo Mentaiko flavor, whatever those mean. So, in our first and second video, first video there was a toilet bowl stick. Literally what we called it. It was horrid, and it was this. I don't remember the flavor. <gasps> that doesn't look good. Second video, there was like the plain version of it, which was okay. I don't know what these flavors mean. It doesn't say like, oh, I, I don't know. So it looks spicy. Yeah. Cause it's reddish. The rest of them are like just corn flavor color, like yellow. Do I have to go first this time or even, or maybe it's barbecue flavor? It might be, it might be barbecue. It might be. It doesn't smell like barbecue chips. We'll put it that way. But it kind of has that look like a barbecue like a, chip. Yeah. <sighs> Am I doing it first or are you doing it first? <laughs> I'm going first. He licked the stick and passed it. It's supposed to be puff, puff, pass, not lick and pass. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> it's barbecue. Okay. That's not bad. It's like a barbecue. Mm -hmm. What did you taste? Not barbecue. It tastes like an overly corn flavored barbecue. Chip. Not chip. Rice cake? Like, way too much barbecue flavor. Really? Yeah. I get corn more than I get barbecue. No, I'm getting that. There's a fly, <laughs> is what you're getting. No, it's like, I feel like it's almost, like I'm taking, I'm eating the powder off of the barbecue chip. Mm. And it's, it's too much for me. <gasps> ah, cat stepping and do it yourself apples. You don't want this, right? No. All right. So. I'll eat that. I don't particularly like it. It's not that bad. I was, I always expect worse <laughs> after that first month where it was literally just horrid. Yeah. 
So I it, it to me it's more corn and barbecue. I'm okay with it. Him not so much. We have two things left. The next one is a candy. We looks like they sent us lemon flavor. Yeah. Looks like there's five different flavor options. We just got lemon. So these are tiny. They look like Smarties. Kinda. They melt immediately in your mouth. Mm -hmm. They're like a meltier Smartie. Yeah. Those are fine. Yeah, not bad. Nothing straight crazy on that one. So we're gonna go back to the gum. I am not gonna, well I guess I can try to pronounce it. Sumi Sumi Kogurashi card and seal gum. Um, don't settle for plain mint gum when you could be chewing on this gum. It contains a card and sticker also. So card stickers, it's got one piece of gum. What the heck piece of gum is it's that? It's like a large square piece of gum. It's like an old school piece of other things. <laughs> ah, it's like acid. <laughs> Just put it on your tongue and let it dissolve. <laughs> Isn't that what it, I mean, I don't know if you've ever seen acid. <laughs> I have not. I am not familiar with um, most psychedelic, well, actually any psychedelic drugs for that matter. <laughs> Somebody else may have uh, experimented with them. You know, in youth. You eating the whole piece? <laughs> you want some? I want a piece. I want a piece of acid. <laughs> Communion wafer. <laughs> it has a weird flavor. It's like a lemon cleaner. Yeah. So whole cleaning products. Yeah. Like lemon pledge. And she's tried it before, so she knows what it tastes like. I mean the smell. It tastes of the smell of lemon pledge. Or lemon dawn dish soap. Yeah. It, not that good. Not good. I wouldn't go buy this gum. No. And it's not acid. So. She's let down by that fact. Clearly. The packaging is cute. They've got a whole bunch of little circular cute animals all piled on top of one another. And here's the card and the stickers. Yep. So, so um, yeah. Yeah. Anyway. You can spit it out. Breach. There we go. All yeah. right. So, the mochi cookies were a big fat no. Mm -hmm. Shrimp chips, he'll eat those. Sakura tea, he'll drink that. The gum, not so much, would never try that again. Nope. The nori potato sticks I liked, which were the seaweed ones. We both liked the Pringles nacho cheese, which tastes like cheddar cheese in the US. Yep. Crushed Pocky, can't really go wrong. Those were easy to eat. Potato sticks, which were the bread sticks, those were fine. A bubble drink candy, whatever. Don't think I'll eat any more of those. Um, the baby food, oh. I, I'd eat it, I guess. Would I go out of my way for it? Probably not. No. Um, those little roasted bean cakes, Yeah. those were fine. Mm -hmm. The do-it-yourself ap apple candy, no thank you. You could eat one and be completely content. You don't need a whole package of those. Right. Uh, the barbecue stick, I liked it, he did not like it. And the little dissolvey lemon candies were not that bad. No. Enjoy your baby food. Thanks. A lot of dissolving things in this one. Yeah. I don't know. Anyway, so that was June. All right. Um, yeah. So we're uh, just waiting for the next box, I guess, to get here now. Yeah. Um, interesting. Anyway. <clears throat> yeah, you can say that. So again, uh, in the uh, description down below, we'll put a uh, link to Tokyo Treats. If you're interested in trying, feel free to um, use the link. And I think you get a discount if you try it too. 
like oh. 10% off or something like that. So. There you go. <laughs> so, um, but yeah. Sorry. I'm a... <laughs> Try Tokyo Treat. It's delicious. Uh -huh. Order it. It's snacks and candy from Tokyo. Uh -huh. mm -mm. Mm. So, if you enjoy our videos and you like hanging out with us, please subscribe, hit that like button. Ding, 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 ding. And we'll see you next time. Sayonara. Bye-bye. <laughs> do I do another ending nope. in case we feel like that's nope. not appropriate? Don't really care that much. Oh.